Hello everyone, welcome to Visit Malta channel. In this video, I am going to explain about Malta Further and Higher Education Authority system. Okay, so what is Malta Further and Higher Education Authority? If you scroll down in this web page, you will see the quality education for confident futures. Especially, it is applicable for the non EU who is coming for a work here uh, with a degree certificate. Okay, so basically, what this department will do is they will evaluate your master's or uh, bachelor's degree or even any education that you are coming from okay so basically they are evaluating your degree is equal to a malta uh, which uh, level of education okay so let me let me show you if you see here uh, apply for an mqrc statement you might be here uh, about MQRIC requirement from your employer or a new company whenever they ask what is the level of your MQRIC this is nothing but uh, nothing but your your education certificate needs to be evaluated uh, by the Malta Further and Higher Education Authority and identifying which level your education is comparative uh, with the Malta education system so you have to apply for an MQRIC statement using your education certificate if your employer is asked what is your MQRIC level of your education okay so let me show you first what are the level that we have okay if you click on Malta qualification database you will see the level starts from A B and number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so this is the MQF level that has been derived by Malta Education Authority if you notice the maximum level 8 is doctorate degree and maximum MQF level is master's degree and even for the school grade is uh, called level 1 degree so this is the level that we, that is being defined by Malta education department when you come up with your degree or master's degree or a school education certificates that has been completed from your country okay now let me show you how you can apply okay in this portal to find which level your education certificate is validated by Malta education okay here if you see apply here for MQRIC statement click on it so MQRIC stands for Malta qualification recognition information center okay that is MQRIC if you see here you will see uh, if your qualification found on the database that has been uh, uh, that has been defined by Malta education system you will have to pay 10 euro and if it is not found it will you will have to pay 20 and um, and uh, it's a different uh, completely for foreign providers you will have to pay 50 euro okay so my recommendation is to just just read information uh, one by one okay before you apply you can click apply here or watch video or step by step or you can click apply here okay once you click on apply it will take you to the next page where you will see recognition of application so here all you have to do is you have to select your information uh, mr and mrs whatever information is applicable for you name and surname and nationality and email and confirm email email is very important do not uh, make a mistake because after you applied for your education certificates MQF level here in Malta you will receive a digital certificate first through your email then if you required you can also request for a postal certificate option okay let me show you what uh, how, how the certificate will look like this is how the certificate will look like MQRIC level once you apply in the portal you will receive the MQRIC certificate a letter something like this which which your uh, which which contain your uh, name and address here in Malta and country of the program where you completed the degree and the university name and it is recognized or not recognized and the title of the degree for example master of science and in information technology and date of award and recognized and MQF level 7 okay so this is important uh, that you have to make sure what level that your certificate was considered here in Malta okay if you scroll down you will see the same information that I have showed you a few minutes in the site this is the same information what are the level that is being defined in Malta qualification framework if you see MQF level 7 is considered as a master's degree postgraduate diploma postgraduate certificate okay 
So this is where you will get the certificate uh, from your uh, uh, MQRIC, Multi Education Authorities. Okay. So after you apply, it will take maximum uh, one to two weeks to receive the certificate because they will verify your certificate by sending email to your respective university and education department in your country and verifying it. If it is a recognized uh, and uh, <clears throat> uh, international certificate, uh, the process time will be very fast and quick. So you will get less than two weeks also. Okay. Now let's go back to the site where you can see how to apply. Okay, here the postal address, it's your, it should be your Malta address, don't get confused because this is where you will receive the certificate and postal code country and um, and what else, the contact detail, Malta mobile number and the home number if you have anything and here, why is the statement required? There is, there is uh, five option which you can choose it, I want to uh, pursue further studies, I want to apply for a promotion job. I want to apply funding scholarship scheme and I need a statement to accompany an application for slip and I need a single permit visa citizenship so whatever is applicable you can select it okay and click next okay which which it which will take you to the payment system where you have to pay uh, uh, 15 euro or 20 euro depends depends the information that you have selected okay so once you select it you will receive the certificate first through your email uh, as a digital copy in two weeks, uh, then if you requested for a postal uh, copy also, draft copy also, you will receive it to your address, okay. So using this uh, MQRIC level of, uh, of your certificate, you can, you can, uh, you can uh, produce it uh, to your employer or citizenship or any other purpose that is mentioned in the application form, okay. And if you ask me, this is compulsory to change job or to get a new job, absolutely not it is not compulsory only some employer will ask you to get this uh, MQRIC uh, level to compare uh, compare and validate your education certificate that you have completed in your country okay so it is not 100% complete uh, compulsory but my recommendation is just to uh, apply for it and keep it in hand because because it is not it is not expensive so nothing wrong to have uh, have validate your certificate uh, for the Malta education department requirement okay so take it and keep it for yourself okay so this is about MQRIC statement MQRIC level if someone is asked about your what MQRIC level of your education certificate okay thank you for watching this video and many of many of many of them is watching the video but never subscribing my channel so please do not forget to subscribe my channel it'll 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 help us more to uh, more to create more videos and motivate us to support you more right thank you so much for your time and uh, good luck